Hello Libra, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley. I'm going to go ahead and do a quick energy spread for you all. This is going to be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs and any other major placements in which you may have Libra in your chart. Very, very important to remember this will not resonate with all Librans out there. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If it is not your story, it is simply not your story. Leave what Take what resonates and leave what doesn't for who it was meant to reach. Ooh, I heard like a ruckus. I don't know if some of y'all are going through a lot of chaos or if the weather is bad wherever you are. Let's see, Libra. This is going to be your 2-22-22 portal energy read. Let's go ahead and get started. One more for the mutual. All right, Libra. Okay. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel. I would greatly, greatly, greatly appreciate it. This is your energy, Libra. This is your surrounding, and this is the mutual. Let's see what's going on. Okay, your energy is very, very heavy at the moment. So, Libra, you have the Three of Swords in reverse, the Six of Spears, the Eight of Cups, and the Moon. Oh, Libra, this is your energy, okay? So, I think that you're coming out of a... I think that you've healed a lot of things in your life, Libra. With the Three of Swords in reverse, you have healed, you have... You have past trauma and hurt that you've been able to get rid of. You've come out of this energy. You've healed it. But for some of you, um, you know, just be wary that maybe you're just just be cautious that you're not putting a sleeve over your heart, right? To where you just don't feel anything anymore as a protective defensive mechanism, you know? Um, I do think that you've you've come a long way from healing some pain. It could have to do with a person. A person, it, it's possible that a person has caused you pain, um, or a situation in particular has caused you pain. I just keep hearing the golden age, the golden age. I don't know what that means, but the golden age. Um, for some of you, that may resonate. For some, it may not. I do think that you've come out of the cold and, and you've really validated your emotions and your feelings in, in regards to a lot of things. Why? Because the six of spirits, you've acknowledged things. You've, you've paid attention to your surroundings, to your feelings, to your emotions, to your mental state. The six of spirits talks about victory. You've come on top. You have come on top. You have recognition. I, I'm getting strongly like a lot of you are recognized very well at your work, at your position in your career. Um, I also feel like you're not only are you, you know, not only are you admired, but there's some that are also feeling like not worthy, like not worthy to be around you for some reason. I don't know why. Like someone is like very upset. Like they don't feel like they can lift their head up with you. You see how the horse is kind of looking? But you're looking straight, Libra. You're fine, okay? Like you've really done your work. And although things may be fine at home, I'm getting strongly like with the Eight of Cups in reverse here in the moon, I with the Eight of Cups, it's almost like you feel like nothing's, nothing's wrong. Nothing's going wrong. But... You know, I feel like something's missing. I feel like something's lacking. The Eight of Cups talks about, am I settling? Am I settling? Am I fully fulfilled? Am I fully satisfied with my life, with my home, with my career, with how I treat people, with how people treat me, with what I've seen, what I've done? I'm getting strong, really, Libra, that you're feeling like maybe there's a lot more out there that you want to experience that you haven't done so. And with the moon here, you're just kind of wondering, like, it's a mystery, what what shall I do? I think your eyes are really open and you're feeling a little bit of emotion, uh, a little bit of emotions arising, you know. Um, you remember the portal is open today, loves, the 2 22, 22 and that's the ending of a cycle and the beginning of a new one. And I think strongly it's like, I think something is going to end and, and something new is going to start for you, Libra, but it's a mystery. The moon talks about secrets. It talks about mystery. It talks about not knowing what's on the dark side of the moon, you know? And Libra, I definitely feel like your eyes are open. You're coming into a aha moment where it's like, there's so much things I want to, I want to do. I need to take care of. I want to see, I want to soar. And I think that's really in your energy right now, you know, because I think that you are very accomplished. You have the admiration of quite a few people around you and you've done a lot of healing and now it's time to live. Now it's time to be free and do things that you've always wanted to do, Libra. Over here in your surrounding energy, loves, you have the King of Cups, the Justice, the Three of Spears, and the Nine of Spears. You... <laughs> 
Libra, you have a love for yourself like no other. <laughs> you're very compassionate. You're very loving, especially towards those that you adore. Um, with the King of Cups, though, and the Justice, you always make sure that you are living up to yourself, right? Your standards. You never forget where you came from. You never forget where you want to go. The King of Cups, you have a love of life. You might have a very, a, a, someone that you care for at the very least, but someone that you adore, right? Someone that you would do anything for. And, and on your journey of, of learning how to love and learning how to live, you've never forgotten the justice. Justice is the Libra card. You've never forgotten to also live by your means and live by you and live by what your morals, right? You've never forgotten... Our, yourself in anything and with that three of spears here and the nine of spears i think that there's so much more you want to accomplish that you've been waiting for or you've been putting on hold right with that three of spears this talks about waiting this talks about distance this may talk about traveling there's something you've been waiting for there's something you've been wanting or there's something far away or there's something unobtainable that you feel that you want. And with that nine of spears down, you're you're putting down the worry, you're putting down your blockages, you're breaking through the barriers, and I think you're headed towards it. You're headed forward towards it, Libra. I definitely feel so. And I think that, you know, sometimes you get a little hesitant because you're like, I don't know what's on that dark side of the moon, but I think it just doesn't matter now. You're going to take risks. You're going to not be so reserved because Libra, you're so fair. You're so fair with yourself that now it's kind of like throw the book out the window and let's see what happens because there's only a little bit of time I have left to do all the things I want to do, you know? And in the neutral energy, you have the six of cups in the tower. Some of y'all are definitely healing some childhood curses, some traumas. However, some of you are definitely going to be living some childhood dreams. And some of you are definitely going to be meeting your soulmate along the way. And for those of you that have your soulmate, you're going to really be living it up with your soulmate. Okay, the Six of Cups is that soulmate card. It's the childhood card. It's the nostalgia card. And the tower means an unexpected life event or pivotal point. Like I said, loves, today is the portal. You manifest anything and everything that you've been wanting to manifest the life you want, the love you want, the life you want to live. Go ahead and wish for that today. I definitely feel nothing but great things for you, Libra. <laughs> Underneath the deck where you don't see coming, where you don't expect the devil in reverse. This means releasing toxicity, closing the chapter, throwing all that bad into the portal and sealing the deal, okay? And for some of you, this could be due to, um, this could be stemming from like some, um, maybe a, an overprotective or a judgmental maternal figure in your life um, that has caused you to maybe be a little bit guarded, a little bit defensive, a little bit on edge, but it's okay because I do see a lot of traveling. I do see a lot of forward movement and calm and serene waters, right? You're on the right track. You're on the right path and you're going the route you're supposed to with that six of swords, my lovelies. Woo, Libra, I love it. Let's go ahead and get a moon message for you. If this message is resonating, let me know in the comments below. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel. Greatly, 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 greatly appreciate it. And for those of y'all who are just tuning in, I do have my money sprays available. I just finished making a batch. I only made a few. So if you'd like to get one, go ahead and email me, virgotarotempress.com. I'm sorry, virgotarotempress at gmail.com. Um, to make sure that I save one for you before I ship them out, okay? Give me a moon message for my lovely Libras. I will stop at nothing. You're going to reach your goals, my lovelies. You're going to reach whatever it is you have your eyes set on. I will stop at nothing. And as I said that, I on the prize popped out, okay? Yes, whatever it is you're manifesting, you're going to get it very, very soon. Magic is in the air. A, a pivotal moment, an unexpected, unplanned life event. Magic is in the air. It's going to be very magical. That is what I have for you, my lovelies. Underneath the deck, peach moon. Continue to keep your thoughts positive and be thankful for you are on a path that leads to the soulful love of your life. A new love of life, an ending of a cycle, the beginning of a new one. That is what I have for you, my beautiful Librans. I love it. I love it so very much. Sending you lots of love, light, peace, clarity. May peace always surround you. Love you so very much. Check out everything in the description below if you want to follow me anywhere else. And I will talk to you soon.